Hey, what's up YouTube? This is Real Chief here, bringing you guys another product review. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys this cool item that my mom and my dad got me for Christmas a couple of days ago. And that is this beautiful Rail King Tropicana Orange Juice Refrigerator Car by MTH. Now to give you guys a brief history on Tropicana, the company was founded in 1947 and their base of operation was in Chicago, Illinois, in the United States of America. And if you guys want the rest of the um, full history on Tropicana, I'll have the link down in the description to Wikipedia, so you guys can go check out the whole story from there. But getting on to the uh, actual car itself, this is a very nice looking refrigerator car model. It's got a very nice molded plastic body, just like some of the other cars that MTH uh, has made over the years. Now if we zoom in here, we got some nice detailing including some sprung trucks and some realistic looking metal couplers which do open up. Like that. And the thing with this car is when you press on the tab you actually push the tab back instead of pushing it down like you would on some of the other MTH freight cars. Anyway, it's also got a very nice detailed uh, molded brake wheel on the side here. It's got a really nice molded ladder on the side. Along with a couple of hatches on each side of the car. Now these hatches are basically molded in. They, act, they don't really open up like some of the other um, uh, refrigerator cars do. Like from Lionel or MTH. And on this side, we got the nice Tropicana um, company name. 100% pure orange juice. We got some um, little dates on the bottom here. We also got um, this very nice orange door. There's one on each side. Now the doors do open, but I'm not really gonna open them right now because I don't want to damage them. And these doors are kind of a little difficult to open up once in a while, so I'll save that for later on in the video. And then on this side, we got a little boy carrying um, a dish full of Tropicana oranges. Got some more dates and number boards we got another set of sprung trucks on this side and the operating coupler as well and in case you guys didn't see that I'll do that for you again on by holding the camera up here And like I said, you actually push the, um, the tab back this way instead of pushing it down. And that way it makes it a whole lot easier. So that way, once you press down on the uh, tab here, the wheels won't spark. Just like on the um, other MTH cars where you actually have to push the tab down. But if the power was on, then the sparks would start flying. And that would cause a little short to the transformer and that will turn on the circuit breaker so that you don't really need to do that here all you just have to do is push back on the tab and that'll pull release the coupler to fly open like that that's basically the um whole review of this car i mean it's a very nice looking piece it's almost as identical as another car that I have in my collection, and I'll show you guys that in just a few minutes. But I'm just I'm gonna um, hook up the car with a couple of my other beverages um, freight cars that I have in my collection, and I'm gonna show you guys what this looks like going around the track. Now, before I get on with the um, review here, I just want to take a moment to say that I love Tropicana Orange Juice, and this is definitely one of my favorite looking freight cars that I ever gotten in my collection. And depending on which type of orange juice you get, whether it's um, no pulp or 
has pulp in the orange juice, you're still getting a very nice and tasty, refreshing beverage for breakfast in the morning. Now, it may not be the healthiest option when it comes to having a nice gl glass of cold orange juice in the morning because, you know, Tropicana tends to add some sugar to their orange juice. But nonetheless, it's a very nice um, little beverage to have every morning. And you can also have it um, during special occasions as well. But anyway, without further ado, let's get on with the review. Okay, so I got my train set set up over here. And I'm going to be pulling it with this beautiful uh, Conrail uh, diesel locomotive from, from MTH number 6080. And it's a very nice piece, and I believe it actually has the Proto Sounds 1 sound system in it, which MTH made a very long time ago. And behind it, I'm going to be running my Coca-Cola car from Lionel, which was made around 2014, 15-ish, I believe it was. And this is a very nice car, and Coca-Cola is another favorite be beverage of mine. And behind it, I got this Lionel post-war Santa Fe uh, Super Chief 6672 refrigerator car and behind that I got the Tropicana car along with this Clover Leaf Dairy refrigerator milk car and if I zoom out they don't really look too different from each other but the only main difference between the two is that this car here is actually a quarter of an inch bigger than the Tropicana car. And last but not least, I got my Chicago, Burlington, and Quincy refrigerator express car behind it. Alright, so that, that about does it for this video. Like I said before, I absolutely love Tropicana Orange Juice. I think this is a very nice little piece of rolling stock. 
and this is going to be a very nice piece to have in my collection over the next couple of years. But anyway, before I end the video, I just want to wish you all a very happy and healthy new year. And I understand that 2020 hasn't been very kind to all of, all of us, including us train fans. But let's all hope that 2021 will pull things around and hopefully we'll get to go to a lot of train conventions again. But anyway, thank you all for watching. Don't, for, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to hit the notification bell for any videos I upload. And you can also check me out on Instagram as well as TikTok for any other videos that I upload. And yeah, that about does it. So thank you all for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Happy New Year, guys.